Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel, and uh, this is to answer a question that comes from a viewer, which is interesting. We often talk about, you know, drivers, and you need to, um, it's good to have updated drivers if you have problems, or if you can't upgrade to a newer version of Windows. I often say, well, update your drivers. There could be an old driver that is, of course, blocking you. And there are drivers that are, you know, updated regularly. Uh, here, for example, if I look at the display adapters, uh, if I look at my GeForce, you see here that there's a driver that was updated in September, and actually there's one now that I haven't yet installed. Now, um, there are some that update, and there are some that stay old, and a lot of people, um, have been, actually one major question was, Okay, I've got, you know, some of the uh, the drivers in my system that are old. Like, for example, look at this one. Driver date, 21 June 2006. How can it be on a machine that is actually uh, a machine that's been built uh, less than two years ago? Well, it's simple because there are some basic drivers that pretty much never get updated. They are the basic drivers that are rock solid, that we know our performance are okay, that everything's all right. And unless there's a major change, they will often keep that driver in there. So a lot of your drivers might be old by several years and even more than 10 years. Don't worry. It's not everything that is updated all the time. It's not every driver that gets an update for um, you know to, to make it as as uh, recent and as new and shiny as possible it is very specific things that will have uh, drivers that will uh, you know be updated due to different uh, features usually the major drivers that are uh, important things like um, you know your graphics adapter your um, the drivers for your network card or Wi-Fi card um, things like that will be updated quite regularly because they have all sorts of new um, updates that might actually improve performance or, you know, there could be some bugs. They are um, really, really more recent devices also. Uh, so, of course, a driver of a device will go with its technology. So, you know, the one on the hard drive that you've just seen uh, earlier at 2006, well, that's, you know, a... A regular SATA R drive that is old technology that relies and works the same way that it did 20 years ago. It just needs the you know good old driver and it works. While there's new technologies like the Wi-Fi might have you know you might be at Wi-Fi 6 or Wi-Fi 5, and that means these are recent devices. They will have more recent drivers. The age of the hardware used also often as in, um, you know, will tell you if there's going to be some updates or not. Recent hardware will often have several updates up to a certain point. As a computer ages, the manufacturer of the hardware will stop providing updated drivers. Why? Because, of course, there's the marketing side. They want you to eventually buy something new. But there's also... Another side to it, it's that they might have updated the driver to a point where it is extremely stable and will do the job for whatever life of the device uh, after that. At the same time, some of the drivers that are never updated could eventually mean that the next version of Windows 10 could be one that you're not going to get. Microsoft doesn't play a lot with that side of things, but we know that from time to time, they will issue a little message saying, well, the next you know feature update, if you have this technology in your computer or if this old driver in your computer, uh, well, that's not supported, so you won't get the latest, you won't get the newest update because of that. Uh, we've seen it a few times happen in the last five years of Windows updates uh, with feature updates with older devices. And it's, you know, it can happen in the future also with some feature update that might leave you behind because of some hardware that's getting too old or a driver that's too old. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.